everyone. Welcome back to PJ's Cake Class. Today we are going to answer a question from my YouTube subscriber. The question was, can you do a video placing, extracting a curve from an object that you can use to sweep the chain? So here we are, uh, a chain around a sweet potato. So in order to do that, we actually have multiple ways to uh, having a surface, a curve on the surface. First, under the curve menu, you have curve from the object and you can extract this ISO curve. Or we can go to the top view or the front view, whichever view is better for you. We can project the curve to the object. Or we can use a freeform drawing interpolate on the surface to draw the curve on the surface. And then after that, you find a satisfied curve. Then we can array and the chain, one component along the curve to create this chain-like um, object. So let's get started. I'm at the ghost view now in the perspective view and um, you can already see this wireframe over there so to get one of them out uh, you go into the curve menu from the drop down menu on the very bottom the second one is curve from the object and then you can extract the ISO curve so you pick up the surface and then as, as soon as I pick up the surface you, you will see the line follow my cursor and then you can click on anywhere to have this ISO curve. Now, if you go to the menu right here, you have toggle. Click on the toggle, you will go into other orientation. So that's how you get those curves. Let me change them into the green color so it's easier to see. <coughs> easier? Might be. Okay, let's uh, make it into a red color. All right, so that's one way to do it. The second way we can do is we are going to use uh, the curve tool. If you go to the icon here, curve the third one, interpolate on the surface, uh, you have to draw into either top front or right view. Um, let's go to the top view. And I'm just gonna pick up this surface and I will just like draw it directly on it. So if you go back to the perspective, you will see that it's attached to the surface perfectly. So that's another one to creating this surface. The third way, let me delete those, um, is go to either top front or right view, and we wanna do the project, and that's what I did on my demo. So I'm going to draw a curve that look like this, and you can draw as complicated as you want, just make sure that the chain that you're going to array later on is not too big if your curve is really complicated. All right. So on the perspective view, you see they stick with C plane, which is a construction plane. And I'm looking at the top view, and I want to project this to my sweet potato. So I'm going to project. You can type it project or they're living under um, the icon, the, this little icon projecting curve. And I will ask you to select curve. So I want to select both of them. Hit enter. And I want to select this surface. Hit enter again. So now let's go back to the perspective. You will see they are curved wrapping around this sweet potato. Now I no longer need this original curve so I'm just going to delete it okay so now we have this curve then we can have any object on the surface to shorten the, uh, the video time I'm just gonna use a sphere putting right here and then I'm going to use the transform under the transform you have a ray and a ray along um, the curve. So I pick up this object and I hit enter and I pick up this curve. Then 
I'm going to try roughly about 45 and see how it look. It's not touching, but you get my idea for wrapping around. So this is the short video for answering the question how to extract the surface on uh, extract the curve on the surface. I hope you enjoy, enjoy it and I'll see you next time on my other video. Thank you.